Hey guys, Dr. Corey here. Um, we are going to go over a question that we've been getting a lot um, in the clinic on social media uh, about intermittent fasting. Okay, is it good? Is it bad? You're hearing a lot more of it. Um, so I'd like to, we're going to start handling questions as they come in. So I'll challenge you after this one. If you have any questions, PM me um, or go to drcorey.com. So just type it into the, in the info thing of anything you'd like to hear. I'll do a quick little video. We'll go through some things to keep educating you guys at home. So intermittent fasting, good or bad? And I'm going to say absolutely fantastic. Okay. Intermittent fasting is amazing. All the benefits of intermittent fasting um, are, are there. They're peer reviewed. We actually use intermittent fasting or type of intermittent fasting in the Dr. Corey uh, fat loss system because I love it and I love the benefits uh, as far as health. Weight loss happens to be, um, you know, a side effect of that. So um, here are some of the things on intermittent fasting. Okay. So number one, cell repair. So this whole six meals a day thing is old news. Okay. If people are teaching it, we used to teach that about eight years ago. It's kind of old. It's always uh, dealing with uh, stabilization of blood sugar levels. And what we figured out is blood sugar is, um, is, is kind of the enemy it plays with insulin spikes. Insulin also plays with cortisol, which is a stress hormone. So we want to get away from that blood sugar roller coaster that every American is on, or it's just a majority of Americans are on, which shows us why 67% of Americans are obese or overweight. That roller coaster, get off of it if you're on it, okay? So, cell repair helps the body uh, um, repair and regenerate, intermittent fasting does. Uh, longevity and disease prevention, so just using some of the intermittent fasting. I'm not gonna go into huge details because there's a lot of types of intermittent fasting. If you want me to go into detail, PM me and I'll go into detail, but for right now, we're gonna, we're gonna stick on the top level. Um, Insulin levels. Insulin is a big problem we deal with uh, in the fat loss industry is, is fighting insulin and insulin responding with cortisol and holding fat right around that midsection. That's why the lipo laser is probably one of our busiest services. It, it helps us target that as long, along with our, um, our HPA access or a fat loss program that targets that system. Um, so insulin levels help actually great for uh, type 2 di uh, diabetics. Research is out there for it. Um, growth hormone. That's where I love this. I'm going to be turning 40 here soon. So spiking um, growth hormone levels as well as the next one, testosterone. Great for hormones, okay, and hormonal production. Uh, like I said, testosterone. Men, if you're dealing with low T issues, intermittent fasting, you know, starting of intermittent fasting would be a good thing for you along with adding uh, good nutrition to that. Uh, losing weight. I mean, 20 to 35 pounds is what we're dealing with uh, as far as the, the Dr. Corey weight loss program, all right? It works along with the nutrition. Metabolism increase, get your metabolism rolling. This whole thing of six meals a day and, and, and boosting metabolism, like I said, old news. Um, giving the body a chance to uh, rest as far as digestion and actually get the body to say, hey, let's start utilizing fat and, and boost metabolism. Stress and inflammation, everybody in America has this right now, right? We are fighting inflammation. That's what our clinic is always doing is inflammation. It's everywhere. And a lot of it's internal. What you eat, boom, low back pain. Believe it or not, it's true, all right? It inflames much easier when you're eating junk food. We got to get away from that. Um, heart healthy, cancer prevention, and gut health. Gut health is a big deal, okay? Leaky gut, all of that's a big deal. Um, a lot of the times when we do our, our, our fat loss system, people come in with a barrel stomach, fat on the outside, barrel stomach. A lot of that is guts are broken. You eat a carb and you bloat, brr, hold water, retention. And that can even be with like a healthy vegetable, okay? But with those broccoli, some of those more, more fibrous ones will bloat you. You're fighting a losing battle. You can't win that battle unless we fix gut. One of the best ways to do it is intermittent fasting where you take a burden off of the digestive tract, we're treating it as we do that, okay, with some good um, foods that will help heal. So we treat the gut as you, take, um, as you take the burden off the digestive tract. Let it heal, give it a rest. If you constantly are throwing pizza and bad foods, processed carbs, um, artificial sweeteners, all of those things into the system, it breaks it, okay? And it will break it 100%. It will always end that way, okay? So don't think that you're, you're gonna get away from that. It, over time, it will lead to destruction. So we've gotta stop that, all right? We've gotta stop it. 
Um, intermittent fasting is a great way to give it a rest so it heals. That's one of the biggest things when we do our, our inches in fat loss is inches go whoop. Why? Because we're taking the burden off of the digestive tract. So is intermittent fasting great? Absolutely. All right. Um, you know, there's a lot of different ones out there. PM me for questions. Any other questions you'd like me to do a quick video on? I'll try to keep them short and sweet because you're probably in, at your desk with good posture at work watching these. So uh, intermittent fasting, two thumbs up from Dr. Corey. Um, and uh, a good thing with this is here's the thing. Don't just intermittent fast and eat bad. Okay, so just skipping a meal and then eating pizza and pop and all that, is it, I mean, I suppose it's a little bit better because you're skipping some of the bad foods, but the key to intermittent fasting is bringing in good whole foods, okay? Bring in some of the healthy fats, bringing in some of the low, um, you know, the, the lean proteins, all those things, the, the veggies, all those things play into this. So start intermittent fasting.